Koi won 2017. To assist me in answering the question, I'm going to start by setting the expression equal to f of x. That allows me to tell the examiner what I'm substituting. We're dividing by x plus 3, so if I set that equal to 0, we get that x is minus 3. So when we divide by minus 3, the remainder is a. a times minus 3 squared, so that's 9a. 8 times minus 3 is minus 24, plus 20 has to equal a. Rearranging the equation, 8a equals 4, so a must be 1 half. I'm going to start by expanding the brackets. 3 times 2x gives me 6x plus 3 minus, and then we have x squared plus 3x minus x minus 3, and we want to know when that is less than 0. We have a minus x squared with 6x take away 3x, which is 3x plus x, so that is 4x, and with 3 take away minus 3, so 3 plus 3 which is 6. To solve a quadratic inequality, the first thing we need to do is find the critical values, and that is when the graph equals 0. I'm going to multiply 3 by minus 1 just for the critical values, and then I'm going to factorise. And now I see that it's not going to factorise. The factors of minus 6 um, 6 and 1, 3 and 2 are never going to give me minus 4, so I'm going to use the quadratic formula. x equals minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a, which gives me 4 plus or minus 16 plus 24, which is root 40 divided by 2, so that's 4 plus or minus, 40 is 4 times 10, and the square root of 4 is 2, so 2 root 10 over 2, which gives me 2 plus or minus root 10. If I now sketch my curve, I have a negative quadratic, which is crossing at 2 plus root 10, and is crossing at 2 minus root 10. I want less than 0, so I want everywhere that the graph is below the axes, and the graph is below the axes in these regions, which gives me the solution that x must be less than 2 minus root 10, or x can be greater than 2 plus root 10.